Hi everyone, I'm Sabrina Wong, part of the Audacious Alpha Prayer Connections and Response Teams. I really love being able to serve in the house of the Lord. God is so good. If you're not already part of a team, then make sure you think about signing up at audaciouschurch.com slash teams. Today, I'm so blessed to share with you as part of this new series of Most Meaningful Bible Verses. For me, I would like to share with you from the book of the Luke, chapter 11, verses 9 to 10, where Jesus is speaking. Ask and it will be given to you. Seek and you will find. Knock and the door will be opened to you. For everyone who asks, receives. The one who seeks, find. And the one who knocks, the door will be opened. In Luke's gospel, Jesus is telling us the importance of persistent prayer. He tells a story about how one man went to his friend's house at midnight, asking him for bread to give to his own guest. That friend was asleep though. However, the man kept knocking on the same door until eventually his friend opened the door and gave him as much as he wanted. Going back to our daily life, when we have struggles, we pray. Sometimes we think about why it seems like God never listens to our prayers. This is the reason why Jesus was teaching us how to pray in Luke's gospel, because we always ignore the idea of persistence. Well, we need the realization that sometimes God actually wants us to wait. God needs us to ask daily, seek him continuously and keep knocking on the door. Then in his perfect timing, that door will be open for us. Think carefully. God and us are friends. He is our Heavenly Father. Why does He want us to pray fervently? Well, it's because He wants us to get involved and intentional. He wants to build a true, long-lasting relationship with us just like we see in the book of Genesis. In the past, I kept asking why God didn't just answer my prayers right away. Now, I understand that God wants to make a beautiful relationship with me because I'm not just his creation. I'm his child. It's not just the case of, oh, there you go, and then that's it. Asking God is not just press the button, then you get what you want. Don't treat God like a vending machine. That's not God's intentional at all. Jesus has pointed out that how we should trust him as he's our friend. He will give us as much as we need, like in the parable shared in Luke. That person opened the door and gave the persistent friend as much as he needed. Our Savior will do the same for us. He's a good God. He's waiting for us to push on and press in, persistently asking, seeking and knocking. In Luke's gospel, why did the person still open the door for his friend even though it was midnight? He knew the need was real because of the persistence, staying at the same door and continuously knocking. Today, I would like to set the challenge for you. Keep asking, seeking and knocking. Keep yourself in persistent prayer. Have a fantastic rest of your day, my friends.